when we begin to tithe, we open the windows of heaven. When we begin to tithe, we unleash the blessings of God upon our lives. When we begin to tithe, the curse will be broken. The curse of poverty will be crushed. But if you are not tithing, you will never ever experience financial freedom in your life. I want you to know that one of the ways that we can experience financial freedom is by tithing. And when you start tithing, every curse will be crushed in the name of Jesus. If curses can come upon you and pursue you and overtake you until you're destroyed, I also know that blessings can come upon you and pursue you and overtake you until you are blessed. Did you hear what I say? I pray that may those blessings come upon you. May blessings pursue you. May blessings overtake you until you are thoroughly blessed as you begin to tithe. Somebody shout, I receive. Shout again, I receive. I prophesy over every tither. May the blessings of God come upon you. May the blessings of God pursue you. May the blessings of God overtake you until you are thoroughly blessed. If you believe it, shout a better yes. Shout a louder amen. I prophesy over every tither. May the windows of heaven be open over your life. I prophesy over every tithe that no devourer is allowed to enter your house in the name of Jesus. I prophesy over every faithful tither that the fruit on the ground on your account shall not be destroyed because the Lord will rebuke every devourer in your life. Shout a better amen in this house. I am so glad that I will not have to rebuke the devourer. It is the Lord himself who will rebuke the devourer. The devourer will tiptoe to come into my house. But because I'm a tither, the Lord will say, not this house, not this family, not this business, not this man. Because I am a tither, somebody shouting, yeah.